Happy New Year, everybody. I have three very simple words for 2018 for you. And I want you to think about these words and the meaning behind it because this is what's gonna make you successful this year. This is what's gonna make you the most successful this year. And this is a problem that I find too many students have where they cannot adapt. So if by the end of this video lesson, I make my case about why you need to adapt, then please do leave a comment underneath this video saying, I will adapt. And I find that once you type it, once you start saying it, once you start thinking it, you start doing it and you start acting that way. And that is good. Uh, too many people get into kind of narrow-minded, uh, one-track mindsets where they say, oh, the stock market has to crash. And so they don't go long. Or they say Bitcoin has to go to 100,000, so they don't sell even if there's a 30 or 40% dip. Um, or they say this penny stock has the most amazing technology in the world, I will never sell. And then, you know, the company goes bankrupt. Um, you must always adapt. Or, you know, forget about the whole investment thesis. You know, what if you're in a trade and you go in with a set risk of losing maybe $100, worst case scenario, and then you're down $100 and you're like, well... I still like this company, I still like this stock, maybe I'll give it till 200, and then at 200 you make another excuse, and then 300, 400, 500, it's a very slippery slope. So I want you to adapt to the market. I want you to say, hey, sometimes I'm willing to be wrong. Sometimes I do need to cut losses quickly. Sometimes I don't know what Bitcoin is gonna do. Sometimes a company might have the best product in the world, but if nobody knows about it, or if the market doesn't care about it, guess what? The stock won't necessarily go up. Um, I should also mention before I get into a longer rant about adapting, um, this is the final 24 hours for this holiday sale. Um, I've extended it. We've had it on for several days now. You either want to invest in your education or not. Newsletters, DVDs, guides, um, it is all so useful for you to study the past. So I'll post a link uh, below this video, but final 24 hours, there will be no extensions. If you want to be successful, you also cannot procrastinate. Uh, too many of you guys said late 2017, you're like, yeah, yeah, Tim, I'll get to it. 2018 will be my year. And now it's 2018. Some of you guys are probably thinking, ah, ah you know, there's just so much to do. I'm so busy. Ah, I'll start February 1st. You can always push it back another day, another week, another year, another decade if you let yourself. But if you start thinking, okay, I need to do this right now. Even if you're not into penny stock trading, some of you guys are like, hey, Tim, I like your passion. I like your dedication. I like your discipline, but it's just not for me. That's fine, okay? As long as I can teach you something, whether it's about mindset or, you know, don't procrastinate or making it a point to study hard every single day on what you love. I do love stock trading. I love the psychology of this. I love trying to create millionaires from scratch. I love teaching degenerate gamblers how to uh, basically control their <laughs> craziness. I don't even know what the right word is. You know, I love seeing charts like this. I, I, I love seeing tweets like this. This was Jordan making 50,000. I love seeing charts like this where my challenge student, Ed Bogey, um, I said this in a video lesson yesterday that very few of you guys watched, so I'm going to repeat it a little bit. Ed Bogey has made nearly 50000 in three years, which on the whole doesn't seem like that much, but it's actually incredible because, as you can see, his profits are growing. Steven Johnson, same kind of thing, where they're losing or they're you know not making much money, and then all of a sudden, it clicks. And it's not on any one trade. It's not on anything miraculous. It's... Thousands of small adjustments adding up over time where you learn what not to do, learn what not to do, learn what not to do. And guess what? It comes back to these three words. I will adapt. No different than this. Um, Corey also has this nice little profit chart uh, where he just totally changed. And uh, John Papa. And by the way, John uh, messaged me. This was all uh, in the past six months. So like five months of frustration and then one month where all those five months added up, he adapted and he made the necessary changes. And now you can see his profits. You know, he's nailing it on a lot of weed stocks, it looks like. Um, so whatever works, but you must adapt. Adapt to the market, adapt to whatever strategy you love, adapt to whatever works best for you. But please, please, please adapt. 
in 2018. And again, if I made my case, this is just a short little video lesson. I made a 25 minute video yesterday that so few of you guys watch. It really pisses me off, but I understand it's the holidays. So today's lesson is nice and short. And I just want you to think about this. Post a little comment underneath this video saying, I will adapt if you understand. And I'll see you guys in the chat room tomorrow. I'm going to send out an amazing watch list tonight. We're going to have a busy week. So get some sleep tonight. Cheers to all you guys. Let's make 2018 great. Thank you.